Hey everybody, I'm Sean. Welcome to another episode of Angling Spiders. Welcome back everybody on today's episode. It is part two of what has already been an epic day fishing out at Clear Lake on opening weekend. Uh, in part one, I caught nine fish and I also caught some big ones. So I will put a link to that up in the corner for those of you that missed it. It's now after lunch and it's time for me to see if I can match what I did in the first part of the morning where I caught those nine. So I would, I'm aiming to see if I can get 20 today, which is a feat, let me say. Um, but it is possible given the number of hits that I had this morning. So let's get to it and uh, I'm going to continue doing what I was doing and I'll explain that in a little bit. So let's get going. I started the morning trolling along the edge with a variety of different lures, mainly Len Thompson's. I also used the lure that I won uh, from Don at Bucktails Outdoors from his new channel, um, Ragged Edge Lure Works. And I caught a very nice fish on that lure. And now I'm back out for the afternoon. I just caught my double digit fish, so that's 10 fish for the day. And I'm gonna see how many more I can get, but I've switched up my lure to be um, a line through pike, uh, eight inch line through pike, because I'm gonna target some of the bigger fish now. All right, so I wasn't getting as many hits on the line through as I wanted. I will try this again later, but I brought the three inch pike as well. So I'm gonna give that a shot, see if they're after some smaller ones maybe, and uh, troll this through the shallows. There we go. Good hit. Nice head shake. This is on the three inch pike swim bait. It's not a huge one, but good fight. Good fight. Oh yeah, that's a decent fish actually. Bigger than I thought, holy man. That is a good sized fish right there. Skinny, but that's a good one. Oh my goodness. Let's not lose the rod, that's a good one. I, it wasn't fighting, that's why I thought it wasn't that big, but that is a good sized fish, you guys. Oh my gosh, I can't get it in the net, there we go. That's a good one. That's a good one. I think this this is my longest of the day, which is unreal because I've already caught a 35 and a half. Or, uh, all right, you guys, if I put that on 35, that extends to right here, which is an additional. That's a 37 inch pike, you guys. That is a 37 inch pike. Not as heavy, I, I think that's probably maybe 11 pounds. It's not very heavy just because it's so skinny. It's already spawned out, but that is a 37 inch pike. Are you kidding me right now? My third fish today over 30 and they've all been well over 30 and that one is almost 40. Unreal, unbelievable. All right, you guys, I'm gonna do the release right now on this beautiful fish. Let's have one last look at it. 37 inches, skinny, but beautiful fish. Okay, everybody, this is fish number 15 i did catch number 14 but my uh gopro battery died right as i was reeling it in um so this would be 15 as i said there's some fish in here usually all about the same size but that's all right and there we go 
My 15th fish of the day. Another 23, 24 inch pike. And gone. Number 16. <laughs> that is water everywhere. And that is fish number 17. Got me a death roll in there. So this is number 18. There it is, that's a decent one. That's uh, probably 27, 28. That's a good fish. That is fish number uh, 19. Okay, we got another one. Same spot. And I really wanna land this one because this would be my 20th fish of the day if I can. Are you kidding me right now? 20 pike on opening weekend. Are you, this is craziness. This is crazy. Oh, I always see that kayak and go for a run. There it is, 20. Touch that leader. Oh, 20 fish, you guys. I cannot believe it. Crazy. All right, you guys, these are the kind of hook sets I love. Look at that, right in the corner of the mouth. We just grab this with the uh, crazy sharks here. That's right out and gone. Oh man, 20. Are you kidding me? Right, we got another one. And uh, this one, if I could land, would be number 24. And uh, outside of a couple of different lakes I've been to, we're getting close to a record number of pike for me in a single day. Oh, he got off right there. Look, at, there he is. Oh, he got off. Right there. So number 24 lose me. I think I'd have to go back and look at all of my records. But for most lakes in southern Alberta, I don't know that I've ever had many more than... I, I think the, the highest, for some reason in my mind, is 24 I've ever had in one day. Um... I could be wrong, but uh, I'm aiming to break that today. All right, I am in a new spot. I have passed that boat and uh, I am going to work this shoreline. No one's been sitting in this spot and I've been watching it. So if there's some fish in here, they haven't seen any lures for a while. There was a hit right there. There he is. Got him. Got him. Oh my gosh. I can't believe it. This is fish number 30. That is my 30th pike. That's a catch. And uh, that's unreal. That is number 30. Are you kidding me right now? All right, there it is. There, there it goes. 30 pike. And now I am going to start working my way back to the van because I am getting tired and I've had enough. I feel like I'm getting burnt and I've put sunscreen on so many times. All right, everybody. So with my 30th pike and my working my way back to the boat launch, which is just over there in the distance, um, I am not going to be recording all the rest of my catches at this point. Um, I will show the highlights if I get crazily enough, if I get to 35 or if I get a big one. Otherwise, I'm just going to enjoy some fishing on the way back and uh, slowly make my way up to this corner across back to the boat launch and call it a day <laughs> and what a day it's been. So you'll either see some highlights or you'll see me at the boat launch.
All right, everybody, so here I am. I was so tired that day from being out there in the sun and the heat and from paddling all day that I forgot not only to film any more fish on my way back to the dock, but I also forgot to film an outro. So here I am in my backyard doing it. And I wanted to let you know, I did catch some more fish on my way back to the dock. In fact, I caught nine more pike. And so that puts my day at 39 Northern Pike for the day. What an amazing day of fishing. I also got to use that fire tiger lure from Dawn and I caught some great fish on it. And in addition to that, I caught three big fish that day. I caught a 34 incher, I caught a 35 and a half inch pike and I caught a 37 inch pike. And I can tell you, I actually lost one that might've been bigger. I got it right to the kayak and it was either 37 or 38 inches is my guess. So what a day of fishing. And uh, yeah, I can't believe it. I'm really, really happy that that was a season opener and I'm glad you guys got to join me and see it. So that puts my yearly pike total so far to 56 pike, which was boosted significantly from that one day. All right, that's gonna do it. I am gonna look forward to seeing all of you in the next fishing episode. And for now, if you like the video, smash that like button, hit subscribe. And until next time, good fishing. And I caught three pike that day over 30 inches and they were all good size, 34 inches. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's try that again. <laughs>